So after many people have kind of reached out to me and asked me to go into detail about the things that are in my room or they liked the way that I decorated, I decided would be this would be a good time to do a room tour. So this is the entry to my room. We have a full length mirror to check our outfits. I hate, hate outlets. So there's like an outlet there. So I masked it with these baskets and balls because I just hate looking at outlets. I think that they're the most ugliest, horrendous things. So this is the entry to my room. Um, there's kind of like an archway when you first come in. So let me come in and then I'll close my door. So on this main wall is my gallery wall. I have just a bunch of paintings, pictures, and things that people have gotten me or that I've collected over the years. My sister bought me this autographed Joey Graceffa poster because I've loved him since the start of YouTube. Um, a friend of mine got me this Marilyn picture from Seattle because I love Marilyn Monroe. And I love her for other reasons. I'm not the typical gay who just stan Marilyn. I've loved her since I was like 10 years old because I just have always thought that she's gorgeous and different. Whatever. I digress. I have a picture that one of my exes got me. I got rid of him and not the picture. Dumbo because we love Dumbo. Marilyn from her very first ever Playboy shoot. That was actually the first cover of Playboy, actually. Um... Who Gon' Check Me Boo, Sheree from Real Housewives of Atlanta. I have a framed check that my dad's family put a stop to, and I had it framed in this bougie-ass frame to basically remind me that we went through such a difficult time with them and just the death of my father, and we made something gorgeous out of it. So that's why I put it in that, like, $400 frame. Then I have my full-length mirror that I check my outfit to make sure that my shorts are, you know, short enough. These are just my house shorts, so whatever. I have a basket full of my things that my friend Crystal has gotten me and other things. A Voodoo Britney, Dumbo, a gold Mickey because we stand gold. And yeah. And then you kind of come around. This is my bathroom. I will show you that next. This is the world's smallest closet. I will not show you that because I'm embarrassed of it. And then this other wall, I just have a bunch of eclectic things. That's my opinion. Things of that nature. So this is only what y'all see behind me in my videos because I sit against my bed. So that's the little entry. You come in, typical room, bed, two nightstands. My color theme is blue, white, and gold. I always say to kind of have one solid color and then one or two um, accent colors. So blue and gold are my accent colors. White is a staple. So I just have my random bedding. Um, you come into the right. I have pictures and stamps from the Titanic. These are actual vintage stamps that were released. Um, my grandparents gave me both of those. They've had them for years and they know that Titanic is my favorite movie. They also got me this SS Titanic plaque. That's from an actual, one of those little boats. What do they call them? The little boats that they escaped in. That is from one of them. I don't know if it was, I don't know. They just got it for me from some vintage shop. I have a bunch of books that I never read because I don't read literature. I read people. I love fake plant and floral arrangements because they just don't die. One less stress. I have a picture of Gabriella and I when we were little on Christmas. I have an oil diffuser and then I have a cosmetic fridge that my friend Crystal got me for my birthday this year. Um, I have a lot of just, ooh, almost fell. A lot of just like expensive serums and fresh face masks under eye patches and like a roller ball. I love this thing, it's so cool. And then underneath I have my backpacks my gym bag, my dusty beats. I'm actually letting those get dusty. So in a video, I could be like, my dusty beats and blow the dust off. I have my blankets, pillows, just extra blankets and pillows, my pajamas, my vitamin box for nighttime. Pictures. I love pictures. I have pictures all over my room because I just, I don't know. I love seeing myself. Just kidding. And then next to my bed, I have a plethora of lip balms because... Yeah, you can never have dry lips. Who wants dry, crusty lips? Um, both of my remotes to my fans because I'm bougie like that. Um, then you come over here. I have an ottoman with the 20th anniversary Target book 
my Kim Kardashian candle that smells like grandma, more books that I've never read, a fake floral arrangement, um, and an elephant pot because elephants are my favorite animal, my laptop just for aesthetic purposes, and then you come over here, I have two fake eucalyptus and flower things. So my room is just awkwardly shaped, so there's not much that I could really do on this wall. So I did floating shelves, which are literally glued, velcroed, and nailed to the wall. They're not going anywhere. They were the hardest things to put up. I do not wish it upon my worst enemy. Get you a man to do it because I couldn't do it, but I did it. But yeah. I have a bunch of just stuff that people have bought me over the years. I have, this is like my elephant Disney shelf. I have more pictures, Britney, of course, a keep it simple side because that's one thing that I'm not. Me and my Nana that passed away. Me and my friend Jackie, which I don't really talk to her anymore, so I need to change that out. Um, yeah, I have a Kim Kardashian fragrance. I just bought that for the statue purpose. It smelled like grandma, just like the candle trash. A picture of Emma, a Britney quote, a Miranda Sings lipstick, a card, Britney cassettes, just a bunch. Oh, this is from Benihana's. You can order like your alcoholic beverages in one of those. We love Benihana's. Benihana, Benihana, Benihana. Just some random stuff that I got from Target and Urban Outfitters. Um, I have this vintage Marilyn stamp. That hoe was like $80. Can you imagine? And look how small. Look at like compared to my hand. Yeah. Um, I have this framed Britney painting that my aunt actually got me from an auction. I think they were auctioning off things from her Vegas residency, um, her, her dressing room. So my aunt got me that. I don't even want to know how much that cost. So then you come over here. This is my TV that I never watch. I always just watch YouTube or whatever. I have all of my Britney vinyls in this basket with iconic Britney Rolling Stone covers that are like in plastic. And then you come over here, my little sitting area that I never sit in, my bougie Dyson air filter slash fan. It was almost like 350. I don't really, oh, there's our neighbor mowing. He like never mows. Let's just watch him struggle. Yeah. Anyways, so yeah, my room is in the front. Don't be trying to creep in because security will get you. I, this is normally where I film, so I put my phone here, and this is normally, like, the area that you guys see. Um, yeah. I hate the fan. I like the fan because it purifies the air, so it makes me feel like I'm breathing bougie air. But it's just so bulky. Like, look at how, it's just big. And sometimes it's noisy. So I don't know if I want to keep it because it's just ginormous. I feel like I need, like, another table to put it on. But I have more pictures of... Um, me and my best friend Amanda, my cousin Haley and I at Disneyland because we love Disneyland. That's like our family's thing together. A dream catcher that I got from Flagstaff, Arizona when I visited my grandparents. And then here I have my crystals. So I have my manifestation jar and my journal. And I put all of my crystals around them. I really like crystals, but... If they're doing anything, I don't know. I just like to believe. Believe in something. That's what I say. Um, I got this canvas. I don't remember where I got it from. It was expensive. It was hard to put up. And sometimes I'm afraid that it's going to fall on top of my head and I'm going to die in my sleep. But you know what? I wouldn't mind dying in this room. Um, I mean, I almost did. But yeah, I don't want to get too dark. So yeah, that's basically my room. It's pretty simple. I decorated everything by myself. I... Went to Target, Urban, Kirkland's, uh, Pier One, all over the place to just put my room together because I had a vision. And once the vision came to life is when I was truly happy. So, I mean, there's more that I would like to do with it. I want to get curtains and, and things like that, but I just haven't found any that have really spoken to me. So, yeah, that's my room. This is where I film. This is where I am most of the time when I'm at home. And then I'll show you my restroom. So my restroom theme is black, white, and Britney. When I was little, I have always loved Britney since the dawn of time. I mean, since like 1998, and my dad never really let me do anything in regards to my love of Britney. So I vowed to myself that I will have my bathroom Britney themed because no one will be able to tell me nothing. So you walk in and yeah, let me show you. 
So over on this wall, there's my room. I just have a bunch of Britney quotes. I have an actual vintage headshot from 1998 from Jive Records. Um, actually is signed on the back. Why it's signed on the back, I don't know, but whatever. My skincare, Britney quotes every day, all day long. And then over here, I have the framed picture of when she won the VMA for video of the year in 2008. I consider that like her comeback, I guess. And then I had this canvas made for me. Um, yeah, I mean, my toilet. This is the shower that I put on concerts and I dance and I jam to. Um, it's pretty big. It's like a step down. I mean, you can fit like three people. And then I have like the water that just shower, rainfall, whatever. Um, I actually had a company make this for me. It's a quote. You can read it if you can read, because I don't want to read it. Uh, my towels. And then behind this, I have so like my morning towel, my nighttime towel, because who wants to use the same towel? And then you have the mirror, um, my medicine cabinet, and yeah, so that's my room, basically. It is what it is, you know, it's a room. But yeah, thank you for touring my room with me. If you have any questions about anything, just, you know, you can reach me. If you need help decorating or you need my advice, let me know. I might do a home tour because I have decorated everything in my room, everything in the home, except of course, my sister and mom's room. So yeah, this is my room. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, yeah, so until next time, I think my next video I was gonna do like a Q&A maybe. I don't know, maybe another mukbang because who doesn't like eating? So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching my video. I hope you liked my room. And a lot of people have not seen my room, so y'all should feel special. Y'all literally know where I sleep at night. Literally. So yeah, thanks guys.